Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Anchor Advice. Uh, this is going to be a Gemini reading for February 24th to the 28th. Of course, there's a whole bunch of Geminis out there. This is not going to be every single Gemini story. Take what's yours, leave the rest alone. Also, feel free to swap around the energy. I could always be talking to a cross-washer or someone that you're dealing with. Okay, this is going to be you versus them, Gemini. Two more shuffles. I could shuffle correctly. Last shuffle, Gemini, February 24th to the 28th, 2021, Gemini. Okay, um, right now you guys could be kind of going with the flow, appreciating what you have, um, taking off your mask and chop wood. So, you and the person that you're dealing with might be starting to uh, kind of deal with the reality of the situation or reality starting to hit them. Um, yeah, to the sea here, I feel like you're trying to go with the flow the fates so this is kind of you guys were meant right here with the face this to me is kind of like um the twin flame card like it's kind of meant to happen it's fate yeah clean it up meanwhile your person is probably needing to clean up their behavior or trying to clean up their behavior or trying to fix the situation and it's like you know i feel like there's really nothing to fix because i feel like with that to the sea you're just trying to go with the flow you know, it's like um, you're trying to forget with what happened in the past. Meanwhile, with Clean It Up, your person is trying to fix things. Um, TikTok. Flexible. Yeah, you could have bent over backwards for this person in the past or vice versa. But I feel like, again, with the flexible and soulmates, you guys are trying to go with the flow. So let's take a look here. Gemini, February 24th, 28th, 2021. Gemini. You versus them. Two more shuffles. Last shuffle, Gemini, February 24th to the 28th. 2021, Gemini. Yeah, Eight of Wands. You could be at this crossroads here. You guys could be communicating a lot. Um, I feel like, and that's kind of giving a lot of confidence back into the relationship as well as you're gaining your confidence back in yourself um, because it's kind of like you learn to release and go with the flow of this. Uh, with the Knight of Swords, Four of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles. You might be dealing with more than one option here. But I feel like your person is trying to speed this up. Meanwhile, you're just trying to save up money. You could even be holding back. Um, trying to get a new job. To increase your stability. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles. To increase your stability. Um, then your person, you know, I feel like because of they're kind of toxic or kind of obsessed with this situation. So, you know, they're wanting to speed this up with that Knight of Swords and the Devil card. You know, they're wanting to go fast. They're wanting to even, um, might even want to sleep with you already, Gemini. Uh, you could be dealing with the Capricorn. And with the Judgment card, they could be kind of judging this situation too harshly. Because um, with that Four of Pentacles, I feel like you're just holding back. You know, you're trying to go with the flow of things. Maybe even save money right now. And then with the judgment card, you know, they're judging this, judging themselves, judging you. Um, with the high priest, they could even want a marriage, want a commitment. You could be dealing with the Taurus. But again, I feel like, you know, you're just trying to take it slow because you're working on your stability. And Page of Pentacles, they could be reaching out to you. Or trying to give you something. Uh, with that five of swords again i feel like you know you might need to tell this person look it's not it's not you it's me um type of thing where it's like i'm it's not that i don't want to be with you it's that you know i'm, I'm working on my stability that's just that's just all it really is gemini um page of swords they might be a little bit immature or they don't really know how to say how they feel with that page of swords here um and with the suspended person this is something that they kind of need to work on um I also feel like they're keeping tabs on you, too. So, let's see. Gemini, what's the Knight of Swords? But I feel like, you know, they're just kind of wanting to rush this. Uh, Nine of Wands. And it's like, it's because of their insecurities. Or it's like, they're afraid they're going to lose you. So, they have to speed this up. And it's like, um, you know, with that to the sea, I just feel like you're trying to go with the flow right now. You know, and this is making them kind of insecure. And, or because of their low self-esteem, they're wanting to speed this up. But with that Queen of Pentacles, I feel like they're very stable. Um, and with that Knight of Pent uh, King of Pentacles, I feel like you're working on your stability. What's the Four of Pentacles, Gemini? You see Ace of Cups. 
you know, it's like you're holding back because you're just choosing to be like in love with yourself. You're choosing to be in a relationship with yourself. You're choosing to spend money on yourself. You're choosing to spend your time on yourself only right now. Uh, what's the nine of pentacles? See, you could miss them, but I feel like right now with that six of cups sideways, only some of you guys miss them. Others of you Geminis are just, again, just focusing on yourself with that Nine of Pentacles. What's the Devil card, Gemini? See, it's like they're afraid you're going to walk away. They don't want to end this with that um, Eight of Cups upside down. But here with the Four of Cups, they do not like how slow this is going with that stagnant, how they haven't really seen much um, progress from this. But the antidote to a toxic relationship is taking it very slow. So, you know, I feel like this person could kind of tend to be used to toxic relationships, tend to just jumping right in and it's going really fast. And so because it's not like that with that four of cups, um, it's going really slow, really stagnant. And I feel like the relationship can be happening. But with that four of cups, you know, they're not liking the pace of this because they're used to something fast. And this is something that they need to clean up. This is something they have to work on um, about themselves. Uh, you could also be dealing with the Capricorn or a Taurus here that, you know, um, they're being way too judgmental in this commitment. You know, I feel like, you know, it's just going slow. That's just the truth. It's just going slow. That's it. And, you know, they're here like, oh, I want this to go faster. You know, why isn't my Gemini doing this, this and that? And it's like, you know, just take it. You know, we're just taking it slow. I mean, with the fates here, it's meant to happen. It's just you're taking it slow. That's it. Taking it slow. And this is something they have to work on with that. Clean it up. Um, they have to work on themselves. Work on their own emotions. Uh, what's the Hierophant there, Gemini? See, Seven of Pentacles. They want to invest in some sort of commitment with you. Um, but I feel like this is often the Reap What You Sow card. Or, you know, maybe in the past, um, they didn't really used to tell you what they would think. And so now it's like, you know, they're thinking all these things. And they want to know what you're thinking, Gemini. And it's like, you're just taking it slow. You're just, you know, working on yourself, working on your stability. Um, some of you guys miss them. Others of you guys, you're you're more concerned about your stability right now. Um, and however they feel, that's on them. You know, it's just like, um, so let's see, what's the Knight of Cups? See, Five of Pentacles. See, it's like you're wanting to take it slow because with that Five of Pentacles, you're not where you want to be financially. I'm not saying you don't have money, you know, I'm just saying you're not where you want to be. You know, you wish you had more. What's the Knight of Cups, Gemini, February 24th, 28th? See, Ten of Swords. Um, what's the Ten of Swords, Gemini, February 24th, 28th? See, and this, what this situation, taking it slow, is allowing, it's allowing an end to the insecurities. Because when it starts fast, it ends fast. You know, it's a trauma bond. Versus here, it's like it's putting an end to the ego, an end to the toxicity. Um, right now, I feel like you're just not focused on that. With that King of Wands sideways, only some of you Geminis are focused on it. Others of you Geminis are not that focused on it. Others of you guys, um, you're using this as kind of motivation. This person, you missing them as motivation. Uh, what's the Page of Pentacles? You see, but with that Six of Swords, this is an emotionally stable emotionally stable connection going from rough waters to smooth waters but that's something that's happening it's not here yet you see with that hermit card i feel like your person is wanting to give you a lot of things uh, page of pentacles gemini february 24 28 but i feel like with that hermit card this is something that they're learning to do is pull back their emotions learning how to be more balanced um learning how to go within change their perspective because the Queen of Cups is someone who has love, has lots of love, but has boundaries. So if, I'm not saying, I mean, you could be dealing with the masculine, right? It doesn't have to be a feminine. But I feel like with that Queen of Cups, you know, um, it's learning how to not be so giving, you know, have be giving, but have boundaries. So with that Hermit card, Ten of Pentacles, you're working on the instability. But I don't feel like that this, what's the Ten of Pentacles upside down? Gemini. See, it's like, because this person probably tends to just jump into things, wants to rush things. And with that Queen of Swords, this is something that, you know, you're not really trying to do. And they're having to learn how to speak up and say what they want. You know, because maybe in the past, this person has a problem with not really saying what they want, Gemini. So, 
you know, it, it leaves a lot of confusion. And right now it's like you're you're just focusing on yourself. And this person feels kind of a lot, you know, feels some type of way about it. And it's like all they have to do is say what they want. Hey, I want something stable, ten of pentacles. I want a family. I want something long term also. You know, they can just jump into this and expect you to know what you're wanting. Um, with that eight of cups, you know, this is some baggage they still have to walk away from. Um, and it's also that they don't want to walk away from this. So, Gemini, see the romantic, those feelings are real and worth exploring here. So, February 24th to the 28th, 2021, Gemini. See, they, there's, there's divine timing here, you know, because uh, with, see, with the full card and healing family issues, this is something that they have an issue with where they're probably like a serial dater. Um, it's not necessarily a bad thing, Gemini, but this is something that, you know, they're used to just jumping into one relationship, into the next, into the next, into the next. And it's like whenever things hit the fan, they're wanting to leave, you know. And it's like, hey, you know, if we take it slow, whenever situations happen, then we will be able to actually talk about them and work through them. Because this person learned how to communicate with that Queen of Swords here at the bottom of the deck. Queen of Swords, Ten of Cups. Where it's like, you know, they learn how to um, communicate from a place that's not so emotionally attached. You know, they could be more open about saying how they feel with while being at peace. Versus like, oh, I'm going to tell you how I feel and, every and I, you know, it's over. You know, it's like the world is ending when one situation happens. Um, see, with the lover's card and the seven of swords... You know, I feel like this is something that, again, they have to work on, clean it up. Where, you know, this is something where they kind of sabotage the relationship in. Um, this is a strong soul connection. You could be dealing with another Gemini. But I feel like this person needs to kind of understand that these are just insecurities that they're feeling. Okay, um, I feel like, you know, a lot of you guys are still willing to give this relationship a chance. Um, if there wasn't too much trauma experienced in it, it's just, again, this is an issue they have to work on in speeding things up or in thinking the relationship is over after every single fight you guys have, Gemini. So, um, I feel like, again, what's worth waiting for, this is just divine timing. Um, you know, a lot of you guys could be working on your own stability right now, and that's pretty much it. You see, the feelings are real here, Gemini. I feel like you have feelings for this person <laughs> with that Ace of Cups. You probably have cried for this person, too. <clears throat> But, you know, in the past, you could have asked your friends, you know, should I stick with them? Should I not? Here with keep an open mind, you know, you've been trying to keep your options open about this person. Again, I feel like a lot of you guys are still open to trying this. Um, I just feel like right now you're just working on your stability. And with the fates here, it's kind of meant to happen. Um, let's see. Okay, there's no major cards that number sequences here but all right guys we're going to go and close out here if this resonates with you guys you guys are more than welcome to like share leave a comment and subscribe much love thank you guys so much for watching please take care of yourselves you can also be dealing with the virgo and i'll be talking to you guys later thank you bye